Hi, this is Rishabh Rajan and this is a course on the Moog iOS synthesizer called Animoog Z. Almost a decade ago, Moog released Animoog, which quickly became one of the most popular iOS synths. It used a new synthesis engine called ASC, an isotropic synthesis engine, which used vector synthesis combined with wavetable synthesis to create sound and maximize the touch interaction capabilities of iOS devices to create a really unique synthesis experience. Now with Animoog Z, Moog has released an updated version of the synth and expands on the AAC engine by creating a three-dimensional touch interface for the orbit path. They also expanded on the effects section and added more modulation capabilities. What's really cool is that the app runs on your iOS device as well as in a DAW as an AU or VSC plugin. Most people that enjoy working on wavetable synthesizers really like the ability to customize their own wavetables and you can do that in Animoog Z with its fairly detailed timbre editor where you can even record audio and use that as a wavetable. In this course, we're going to look at all the features I've mentioned so far and everything else that this synth is capable of. I'm not going to assume that you've already worked with the original Animoog synth, so I will also cover the basic synthesis concepts of this synth. Alright, so what are we waiting for? Let's get right into it and discover what the synth is capable of.